how to easily broadcast over Justin TV and just from right from the beginning to getting you on the air of course the first thing you need is uh, some sort of a webcam you can uh, choose an inexpensive one this probably came uh, from like a dollar store type deal uh, just a little Chinese made camera uh, that has a little stand you can hook up to with your little USB cable and a couple of batteries to operate the camera and I'm guessing this thing's probably you know like $25 or probably a little less it's a very inexpensive one and then you can go up to pretty much to the top of the line which is uh, this particular one I use is uh, a Logitech they call the Pro 9000 and it has uh, uh, the advantage of having a gl actually a glass lens instead of the plastic lens which are typical on webcams and it has some good software that uh, provides the ability to get down to low light levels and the frame rate is adjustable in, in the low light so um, what happens is it actually slows down the frame rate to capture more light but then the disadvantage is you'll get some blurring so it's all a trade-off but this is probably one of the better cameras the Logitech Pro 9000 camera and that's the one I use here now the next thing you do is you plug that well first of all you should read the instructions for the camera you have because it'll tell you the order of when to plug things in sometimes you need to plug in your USB cable first sometimes you need to install the software first so read the directions see what the manufacturer recommends so once you've got your camera plugged in then the next thing is uh, go over the software and see what kind of adjustments you need on that typically uh, after you install the software and the camera you have to reboot the computer and what that does is it will load the camera settings into your computer when you reboot your computer and in fact if you ever start having trouble with your web camera just reboot your computer and that usually will solve all your problems so now that once you've got your camera all set up, you got your software installed, you've started your computer, the camera should now, whenever you're using some sort of a web uh, broadcasting program, it'll automatically recognize the camera. So you don't have to make any further settings. So now, for example, let's say you've got your page all set up on Justin TV, you got your screen name and you got your own home page, you got your profile page. Now what you need to do is actually hit a broadcast button to start going. Okay, here's my particular home page. And, or you can use your profile, well this is actually my profile page, but you can use your home page, your profile page, just about any page on Justin TV. If you scroll over to the right hand side at the top, you'll see a red broadcast button. So you just hit that red broadcast button and then that brings up a screen, a smaller screen actually, where you can s now start broadcasting. And it gives several different uh, options that you can choose, but typically everything's going to come in automatically. Now, since I'm already broadcasting, it's given me some things that you you probably won't see. But one of the things you might see is where you have to install a uh, add-in or plug-in uh, that comes from um, the publisher that does the particular. Uh, broadcast encoder for Justin TV so if you don't already, don't already have that plug-in installed it'll ask you to install that okay we're gonna skip that right now but basically what you're gonna do is you're gonna just follow the directions that says that it tells you on here like install the, your your plug-in and then there's a little button down here at the lower left hand side after you've already done that it'll say start broadcast so you just push start broadcast and you'll start broadcasting because like I say all of your settings will already be recognized by the software if you've installed your software correctly and you got your cameras set up and you've restarted your computer it'll show up there so you just press the start button and you're already going and it's as simple as that now some things you might want to consider though uh, before you start broadcasting and, and, and when you're broadcasting is what's your purpose of broadcasting because a lot of people don't really think this through they think oh this is cool I'll just start broadcasting and everybody in the world is going to see me well 
Probably not. You 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 got to figure out you know something that you want to broadcast that's that's interesting to you. You don't want to do some sort of a broadcast that you have no interest in because uh, that's not going to be fun. So figure out something you like to do, and most likely, if you like to do it, somebody else will like to do it as well, and they'll enjoy watching you talk about what, you, what you're what you interested in. So just figure out what you like to do generally, and that will be the clue to some success. Now, it doesn't necessarily mean you're going to get thousands of viewers, because chances are you're not. You're probably going to get a few viewers. But, you know, it's all fun. Just uh, have fun doing what you're doing. Meet some new people, and, and you'll certainly meet a lot of new people around the world. So basically, that's the uh, the easy way to get broadcasting. Just make sure you set up your webcam and your software, reboot your computer, hit the broadcast button, and then you're all set up to broadcast. It's as simple as that. So good luck to everybody and have fun. And there's also help uh, places available on uh, Justin TV. There's the 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 uh, office cam and there's also the help channel that uh, you can log into and see if somebody in there can help. All right, good luck and have fun.